Language must be destroyed to destroy freedom. The so-called experts are experts in the field of twisting and torturing words. Many evil acts can have good reasons behind them. Don't be fooled by fancy reasons to justify a particular act. I doubt this can be entirely overcome, but it can be avoided to an extent. Their goal is to deceive you. As Nietzsche said, they are more afraid of being understood than misunderstood. The masses don't want the truth, they want to be flattered. It's often said that the truth is a tough pill to swallow. This is a true statement. The masses have a desire to be detached from reality. You might even be given correct information. This doesn't mean it's true. It's a lie if the intent to deceive you is the goal. Deceptive information, correct or not, is a lie, often given as a cover for tyranny. The masses are in a state of dependency. Destroying language serves the propagandist and supports tyranny. They must control by opinion. They can attempt to control by brute force, but it can't last. They must get opinion on their side. They can fabricate a fiction now. They can paint a picture of utopia. It's gotten to the point where many are unable to see the truth. Truth is in dialogue with words and their correct definition, not in censoring conversations and using words like Humpty Dumpty. Freedom can only exist with unmolested language. Unbiased ideas, opinions, and truth must exist. Destroying language destroys freedom. Truth is incurred in language. Freedom is incurred in truth. We can have freedom with molested language. Those set on destroying language are set on destroying freedom. These false prophets will continually present a utopia. They have no clothes. Be the little girl in the fairy tale. Many of these evil ideas are popularly supported. They can last otherwise. Opinion can change and can change overnight. They have changed in the past and they can change again. There are many quasi-state institutions that assist in destroying language. People might support different names and different policies, but they are the same in their submissiveness. They want to keep you too busy to think.